Hello, how you doing? Soul Tire here, bringing you part two of my Fourth Age Total War Dominion of Men Let's Play. As you can see, I'm playing as Tharbad, and we've already taken freeways. Uh, now I'm pretty sure Adunabar's going to be well pissed off with me and um, looking to give some sort of retribution. But I'll be pretty much ready for him, I should imagine, and um, we'll see how that goes when the time comes. Now, um, first of all, what I want to do is, um, I'm just going to merge up Captain. my units and send the depleted one back to Tharbad for retraining. Uh, Alright, oh, oh no, I'm going to step that back. I want a spy first. So we'll get that, because we need a spy. Get that sorted there. Uh, back at three ways. I'm Order. just going to take this guy out for a minute. Um, he or last, because I'm sure he's cost us money. 600. It's quite a lot. And what we'll do is I'll give him some army outside of the settlement. Nice, I'll give him a bit more than that. Um, those axemen and those archers. Okay, now then. My next move is to come down here to Londia and um, let me see Carpenters I think would be a good idea that's all our money going now I've taken this um, Freka of Ether out of there as noble because he's pretty shit and I've got this guy in here and uh, I don't know what happened there I got the wrong bit He's a competent governor. Um, I think his traits are okay. I've got a feeling he's quite young, so um, I'm sure he'll progress to be a decent governor. <coughs> providing, of course, I put in the proper sort of buildings and stuff like that that give him retinue traits, whatever. Now, Order. we're going to send this guy up here to join up with the army. And uh, he'll just be foot soldiers because you know we want to copy anything else. Um, I can't. No, I can't do anything else there. I can increase the tax there, and just keep them happy. And with that, I think move to the next turn. Now then. From what I've read and sort of like um, um, in the forum on the Fourth Age forum that is on the Total War Centre, it seems like um, a Dunabar always attack Bree and capture it. So what I'm going to do is not allow that to happen. Captain. Now I don't really want to send him up there. Because he's our heir, I want to, him to take his own to likes of Sanford, etc. here and take these settlements in the area door. And um, I think that's the right way to go. I just thought this went up myself there, that what I'll do is, as I've, I'm, I immediately made an ally with the um, Reunited Kingdom, and I did that quite deliberately. And we're going to go and help them fight off Adunabar at Bree. And as I said, I'll send this army up here. But once I get this other, Captain. this other guy up, he will lead it. I don't want my heir up there. Now, um, I took three ways first. Basically, I mean, on on an idea by um, one of the. Um, Developers this mod I'm in dialogue with quite regularly. Uh, Weber, eighty four, and uh, he suggested taking three ways first, 
and then but one but who's another member of the team suggested doing one or two other things like taking these settlements in Eridor so uh, what I'm doing is I'm using both the uh, knowledge combining it and to, to make it my strategy uh, but this idea of taking Bray as my own or sorry supporting Bray as my own so hopefully I'm making the right decision and um, I just thought I'd credit the two guys for uh, giving me the ideas the, the, to do what I'm doing because, you know, I, I'm very new to the mod and I don't know much about it. Uh, I made a lot of mistakes in my last um, Let's Play when I what was the Kingdom of Dale and I'm aiming not to do the same thing again here. So credit to both of them and thanks for their help. Right, let's get on. Now then, um, what have we got? Yes, spears, we'll get them straight up to freeways. And we'll get another unit recruited. Because they're going to be the mainstay of my army. Um, you can't travel any further. And the rest of it, the, the palisade's done. Alright, um... Now let's see if we can get a little bit of help more animal husbandry and fishing. Well, we'll put that in and then that's that started for that chain of buildings. We've got the carpenters come in there and um, we'll recruit a spy f from there as well and we'll move on to the next time. Okay, now I've forgotten about my blasted emissary, but it's not really that he can do that much, to be honest. There's nothing up to the north here, in Arnor, that, 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 where he can help me with. The elvins were the only ones over there from, you know, obviously you can tell I've had a look at the map. Oh, Greyhound's complete. Um, now I'm not going to build any more there for the moment because I've made that a military rather than financial which some people might not think makes sense because it's you know next door to Tharbad which will pump out my main units but I think it's um, I prefer it that way to have two settlements so next to each other they can pump out military and then I can do two different types of units each time I want to recruit. Stop where I do it, it's not perfect, I'm not saying it's right, it's just the way I'm doing it. Okay, so this army here will now latch onto this fella and you'll just stay here for now. Okay, uh, can I build anything else in grey hole maps where that might make sense? Fishmongers. It's a lot of money. Uh, the pacification should almost be ready in three ways. I think one more turn. So I'll keep my money so I can put the Dominion in immediately. And we'll rec recruit another unit of Spears. Spears the bridge. I should add. Because they are going to be my, let's say, the backbone of my army. Um, now then, Rohan are looking for an alliance and trade rights. Now, as I've got an alliance with uh, Reunited Kingdom and they two are generally um, allies, it would make sense to complete the triangle and uh, at least keep them on board until we can deal with Adunabar, who I'm pretty sure will come up with, with a bit of force. Um, but I'm not going to give it freely let them think we're a bunch of wimps that's not happening we'll get a payment from them um, let's go in high and see how they respond they'll give us 4200 ok we'll take that over two seasons we're hardly likely to break that bond and battle or anything they're too far away, and I'll get 8,400 Marianne, which will come in very handy. There we go.
rotate that. Okay, now um, two more units and over. <coughs> Excuse me. And okay, let's get the five done in there. We can now step up their taxes for a little while with no governor to worry about. Um, I don't know if there's a penalty to that actually. Do you know that's something I never checked out and I should have done? Oh, dear me. Ah, wait. Right. Like I say, I'm still learning. You know what I mean? I'm really depending on my ability to win battles rather than be sort of like an, <laughs> an expert economist. <laughs> um, right now, let's get another unit of. Um, Spears recruited and we'll take Sam for the good time I said 10 turns I think I'm on about 8 at the minute um, now grey home we think I think we can get that mustering field into grey home now and then that's that started ok let's move on Chieftain of Dunlan wants some trade rights. Um, well, yeah, okay, and then we'll ask them for a little bit of payment, see how they respond. I won't ask for much, just to let them know that, again, that we're not any pushovers. You know, they'll have to barter to get anything out of us. And they're happy enough with that, I'll take it. Help pay for another unit. Now then, that's our Lord's Barracks built. Let's get the construction charter up and running. And that's get our so a cavalry unit okay I'm just wondering whether it, whether I should bother with these ships you know how much are they costing us? Oh, they're only 90 or keep them. They'll come in useful at some point, I've no doubt. I suppose depending on how far I want to go with this campaign, whether I want to um, continue or not after I reach the... Uh, <laughs> or if I reach the victory conditions, of course. And Grey Home can get us a unit of these guys. And... We can start getting these bowmen because these guys are going to be crucial yes, to my campaign. Um, I'm getting ready now. I really want to Sir. look. We'll take this army up here. Where's that spy actually? I recruited a spy, didn't I? Let's send him ahead before I do something stupid. Like run into a Dunabar, for example. They're besieging the watchtower. Oh, right. Sir. Best get up here. Oh, here. Is that them? No, that's it. They've got a good army in there, but we just go up there and we'll give them that support. Um, okay. Not a lot to write home about there. And I think I'll put the carpenters. And the library gives us ballistas, doesn't it? Um, I'm not a big user of ballistas. 
and such like um, I very often find they get in my way so a carpenter's reduces construction costs so we'll get that in and um, I'll just delay my attack on San, San, uh, San for, for a, another just to get my um, longbowmen over there because like I say they'll be crucial to me okay nothing that affects me really ah right what we got here then competent governor now there's a chap for um oh minus two to law that's not too clever but he's a competent commander as well so that could be pretty useful let's see this guy rotha inept here oh. on I'll trust him to be a tit. Could have used both of them. Alright, well we don't need necessarily have to put them um did they need retrained actually. We don't necessarily have to make them a governor as as of yet. Yes, Captain Bellag. Let's just bring it back a little bit. Oh, they've taken that watch to her. Sir. You got to join up. Combining troops. Sir. Now, if we take you out, it's not me. Oh, so you can be quite a good governor in there. You'll stay. And then Captain. you can go back up there, mate. Right, we'll get you into there. We don't want that line empty so they can just walk in. Anybody can just walk into it. And uh, Dunland or else a bar in particular, who most likely be the ones who will attack me. Now I'm looking at this swan fleet here and I'm just wondering whether that's, you know, whether I should take that quite soon as well or should I do this area then just come back to it. Um, I'll find out soon enough. Captain. Okay, how are we doing here now? Sir. That's a good strong army up there. Orders. Orders. Captain. Orders. Sir. Captain. Orders. Orders. Okay, don't eh. Uh. Wasn't we about money? I've forgotten all about my emissary again, Making haven't I? Your honor. At once. No more moves. So it's not really that you can do that much for us. I'm, I'm pretty happy where I'm at at the moment. Um, I know we'll need to... Oh, look. We'll definitely need to look at... Um, Let's get him some. We don't really need these guys, do we? But they're cheap. Um, Orders. Well, I don't have those. <coughs> A lot of nobles because I really want to get a good noble in here. I think I'll take him out here for a minute. Oh, <laughs> well done. And we'll put him in here. And we'll. I don't understand this. 
I'm gaining money, yet he's a competent governor. Hmm. Orders. Maybe that was a mistake. I was going to give him these traits before he dies. Maybe not. Okay. Okay, we're pretty much ready, I think. One more turn. I could be doing with a novel or two. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Incompetent, though. <no. laughs> Jesus. Where did they put him into? Oh, he's in the army. Oh, he's up in this army up here. Sir. Where did he go? I thought he went up there. Oh, there he is. He's retrained. Oh, I forgot to recruit somebody. I thought I recruited somebody there. There's a doing a bar there. Now, maybe they might just not. come south because if they do they're in for a bloody shock You're let's on. see if we can move him on we'll send him up once. at once without delay at once and we'll send him up once. here Maybe. Honor, See if there's anything he can get. And uh, now then, we're going to have to start doing something. Uh. Orders! Orders! Sir! Right, we're going to take uh, Sanford. Combining troops! And the next um the next turn. Uh, let's get an axeman from there. Axeman from there. Right, now I think I'm pretty much prepared. I know I've taken longer than what I intended, but um Trying to just make sure I've got a good solid foundation. My income starting to drop, so it's pretty much pretty much time to um, look at taking Sanford. Ready? Attack! Besieging settlement, sir. Okay, now what they got? Spearmen, Eredor Spearmen, are they any good? Obviously, uh, we should be too. So, mind you, they've got good upgrades. Is that because I've waited so long to go and uh, take them? Missile attack hunters. How many hunters are they got? Just the one unit. Scouts, the yeah, skirmishers. Axemen, axemen. So three spearmen, three axemen. One unit of hunters and one unit of scouts. Okay, let's get in there and do the business. Okay, nasty weather. Units, await my orders. 
Okay, well, there's two entrances, one up there, and better looks a bit. Well, I'm really impressed with these cities, you know. Whoever did these models, man, you know, top banana. So, yeah, top banana. This is impressive. Okay, yeah, let's get you guys sorted here. And now these deadly bastards. Yeah, you're only going to be for mopping up purposes. And you two guys are going to be... And we'll put one of you over here. Backed up by those. And the same here. That's cool. And our top kitty. And I think we're ready to rock and roll. Alright. Prepare to meet your doom, people. Oh, they're over there, are they? First of all, let's take some of these lot out. I don't know why Ah, oh, where's... Where's those answers? Oh, don't tell me I'm sitting up here. No, spears. Oh, look at that. That's really impressive, you know. Really impressed with us. That's axe, man. Where's the bloody archers? Archers. Are they up here somewhere? Because they can do a lot of damage from high ground. Oh, they're in amongst that lot there. Oh, back to Specsavers for me. Are here and um, which we can. Bodyguard, swordsman, swordsman. There you go. 
think her heart says are reaching them all right, isn't it? Yeah, looking good. Covering because I don't want them getting too close to those archers are going to um, do me some serious, isn't it? Alright, guys, you can stop now. Stop now. Let's get you fellas, and I'm going to bring you down there. And actually, what we're going to do is take you two down there as well. Oh, who's good? Longbowman. Mm. Longbowman. Right, we'll send you two down there. Cool, what happened to Where did they come from? It's because I put on bloody triple speed and didn't. I thought the dogs got up to the centre square up there to wait. Lost men for no bloody reason there. Yeah. No, I mean, we can get them retrained. Just pissed me off about it because I didn't keep an eye on it. So it happens you take things for granted. I'm myself to blame. Half my cavalry, you know. Not good. So we took the, the plus side. We took out that axeman unit as well. So who's come here? Is this hunters? This is where I just didn't want them, you know. Come on guys, get up here. Now these are armoured guards so they, they should do well against archers. If we just sent in... Oh look at this. Bloody AI is a clever bugger, isn't it? Right. AI and this is... <laughs> And somebody injected it with some sort of extra intelligence or something. And who's this here? They're just scouts. See my cavalry in a potent force now. But I might just have to sacrifice them. Just want to know what these archers are doing. Let's get these boys up. These bad boys here. Let's get them up to there. And you look close behind. Bodyguard. Bodyguard. 
Let's see, hunters. Let's see. Is that a response to being putting the cursor over the top room? <laughs> Could it be that smart? And send them back. Because they're going to take, they're going to give me a load of casualties if I sit back. See, ah, oh, they took up, they took up the spot there. take them in because they bloody arches will pick them off. So, where's these guys here? We want to get them in fast and hard. Quickly. This will make them decide what they're going to do. She think it's. I want to get these hunters before they can pick out too many. Okay. I think as long as we're hiding behind this building, they can't do anything. We'll get up, get them up to there, and we'll get our hunters. Our bowmen into there. I'm not going to take too many hits on them at all. Is that it? Good. Right, now we can get our bowmen up to here fast. And the cavalry up here quite quick. Stay there, gent. I don't want you involved. Except to give a bit of a boost. How did you get in there? Out. General. And again. Right, get these bowmen up here. Turn again a position. There you go. Come on, guys, taking a long time dealing with them.
Why are they facing their own way? Swordsman. Throw a ham left, and you go. How long can you withstand? Job done, should I imagine? Just, is that their leader? Their lieutenant? Time to do it. Ah, oh, now you're done. Yeah! Big cheer, everybody! Yeah! We kicked their ass! But we lost 140 men doing it. Any recoveries? Not bad. 50 60 maybe. So we'll take that. Nice little victory. Yeah. There we go then, people. Thanks for watching, and uh, come back and pick us up on part three. And I'll put the. Uh, I'll put a pacification in there then, and um, we'll have a look and see what Dun Aduna bars up to. Yes, master. On my way. Actually, Secrecy let's go down here and see if they're. No, they're not about. Risk could be interesting. We ain't too worried about them. Yeah, let's see. Thanks for watching, and um, hopefully, we can back and watch some more. Bye now.